Introducing the Valve Works 5636 and 5637 series electric actuated three-way T-port brass ball valves. T-port valves are typically used as diverter valves. When used as a diverter valve, flow enters the left side port and exits the right side port as shown in position 1. In position 2, flow enters the left side port and exits the offset port. These feature pack multivoltage actuators take the valve automation business to the next level. Electric actuators use power to open and power to close. Stays in the last position with loss of power. Ball valves are direct mounted to the actuator with standard ISO 5211 mounting interface, eliminating the need for additional brackets which reduces the size and cost of the valve. These brass three-way ball valves have a Teflon four ball seat design which allows for full pressure at any port. Unique ball and stem seals are designed for lower torque which reduces the size and cost of the actuator and extends the life of the valve. The enclosure provides a weatherproof, anti-corrosive, and UV protected housing. Standard manual override can be used for initial setup or power outage situations. Smaller size actuators use a lever operator with visual position indicator. Larger actuators use a knob for manual operation and a separate visual position indicator. A highly visible LED diagnostic light monitors the operation of the actuator. All electrical connections are external via supplied DIN plug connectors. Wiring does not require removing the cover. Cycle time is the time required to move the valve from the closed position to the open position or to rotate the valve one quarter turn. Motor limit switches automatically stop the actuator in the open or closed position as required. Additional standard features include two auxiliary dry contact limit switches. These switches can be used to confirm the open and closed valve position. A built-in thermostatically controlled heater is used to help prevent any condensation that might build up in the actuator. 